Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, good night, and what's up? Hey everybody, I'm Naturally Stacy, and welcome back to my channel to all of my existing subscribers and to all my new subscribers, hello. Sit down, get a drink, get a snack, and welcome to my Miss, my Gucci Miss Gigi convertible handbag review. And what the heck do I carry in it? Video? <laughs> so, if you guys wanna know how I feel about my newest Gucci purse that you guys saw unbagged a few weeks ago, about a month ago. Stay tuned. Okay. As you guys know, I think it was like um, July, August, I want to say. I went on this crazy, it was in July actually. I went on this crazy tangent buying, I think I bought like five or six handbags between here and in Denver. I bought all these handbags and I just lost my brain. I did, I lost it, but they're all beautiful bags and I've at least carried two of them. No, three, I'm sorry, three, because my tote bag is sitting across the room and I carry that on the weekends. Um, my other Gucci bag, I have to go take in. That's another story, we'll talk about that in another video. Um, but the, the purse we're going to talk about today is this one right here. This is my Gucci Miss Gigi convertible. They're calling it a hobo to, and then I've read it is a tote handbag. This one right here, I'm going to put in front of my face. It is in the color brown. Um, I'm going to show some modeling shots of me from the, uh, from the reveal video that I showed you. From there, I'm because I'm, I'm not doing any more modeling videos right now. Okay, so no, for real. Um, I picked this bag up at a local Reese. Uh, actually, my it was a local consignment shop. I was about to say resale, but it's actually a consignment shop called Bird here in St. Louis. And I remember when I bought the bag, and I think I told I told the story in the original video. I remember when I bought the bag, I was on the fence about it because I didn't know if I truly liked the bag so much. And the more I looked at it when I got home, I was like, okay, I can do this. I can I can do this. This bag is nice. And I remember talking to the the um, sales associate, and she was like, the bag looks lived in. And when she said that and I got home and I was like, it does look lived in and it's comfy. The bag looks comfortable and chill. And that's what I liked about it. So I went ahead and I've been carrying it ever since with the exception of like on the weekends, I carry my Burberry tote that you guys have seen pictures of on my Instagram. And if you are not on my Instagram, I'm gonna need you to do something about your life and go over there to Naturally Stacy and follow your girl. I follow some people back, not everybody. I try to follow as many people as I can, but I know there's a limit of how many people I can follow. So go over and follow me. You'll see a lot of um, handbags, sneakers, selfies, all that fun stuff. Anyway. So this bag has been pretty much my workhorse. I may as well say it. I, like I said, I carry it every day. I normally carry it on the long strap right here. And I, I think I said in the original video, I wish this strap was a lot thicker and I still do. I really wish this strap was a lot thicker. Um, on here on the purse, as you look at the hardware, you're gonna see the signature G's, the interlocking G's, which this is the old school G that they, um, I want to say was what the eighties or the nineties. I think that was the, um, G's that they used on the zipper. Let me lift it up again on the zipper. It has Gucci and on the zipper. I'm going to see if maybe it will give it to me. Nope. Oh, wait, I had it for like a hot second. There you go. You're going to see the Gucci emblem right there. And it has a leather tab to help you zip and unzip. The zipper is smooth like butter. I love the zipper. I can actually carry this on, carry it on my shoulder with the two top handle straps, but I normally carry a crossbody. My purse is kind of heavy right now because I have a lot of stuff in it. So what I, another thing I wanted to do in this video is kind of show you guys 
how much stuff this purse this purse can actually carry this purse can actually carry my ipad i have the what is it the uh, third generation ipad i don't have it right with me it's actually in my bag um from work earlier so i can actually carry that and a few other things in it but let's talk about what is in my bag so you can see what this thing carries because like i said this is a workhorse seriously a workhorse okay let's unzip and let's see what's in the bag first thing i pull out the bag is my cell phone i have the iphone 10 and right now it's 456 and yes you see your favorite kitty who is actually sitting across the room watching me right now and this is what i call her school picture she's actually if you look at this picture this is actually my gucci pelham bag that she is laying on she likes to lay on gucci bags i don't know where she gets it from but she likes to lay on expensive purses i don't know where she gets it from <laughs> but anyway all right what's next let's just go into the main compartment of the purse the next thing i'm going to pull out is my louis vuitton jean wallet you guys saw this uh wallet when i came back from denver in my denver hall i'm gonna have that video linked right up here i love this wallet it is so pretty and it's it's, it's nice and it smells so good too <laughs> the next thing in here what is this anyway the next thing in here is one of my glass cases um burberry glasses this is my these are my sunglasses actually my this is my sunglass case these are my everyday sunglasses that i wear yes you can see my lighting so these are the sunglasses that i wear every day right now well that i'm wearing right now sometimes i, I switch them out and i have other sunglasses that i wear uh next thing is my little makeup bag that i take to work um in here let's see we got some mascara my lip that i'm wearing right now which is kat von d's lolita um gotta have some agua for because you cannot walk around with chapped lips okay uh let's see um contact lens case i got some contact lens solution and some other stuff in here we're not going to get into if you guys want to know what's in my mini makeup bag and my home makeup bag which is i have a train case over there let me know comment below and we'll do a what's in my makeup bag video too before i clean it because i am going to be cleaning out my makeup bag really soon so i need to switch it over to fall and winter makeup so anyway we got a pack of tissue from target which you might find more than one pack of tissue uh next what is this oh this is my um letter about getting my flu shot that i got last week uh so i had to turn it into work so i can get points and i can get some money off my insurance next we got some hand sanitizer from the traitor jewels gotta have hand sanitizer especially this time of year you gotta have hand sanitizer next is a little bag that i carry um woman stuff may as well tampons you know i'm you know always good to have this because you never know if you have an emergency or one of your co-workers has an emergency you have you have to have a little you know have a little bag with you okay this is actually a makeup bag from bare minerals which is really cool and it actually helps in this situation next is a thing of tic tacs with only three tic tacs left so that means i need to go get some more tic tacs uh, next thing in the bag, ooh, it's got stuff on it. It's a little manicure kit. I got this little manicure kit from my sister Pam years and years ago. I, I put a little uh, nail file in there, but yeah, my sister Pam actually gave me this manicure kit years ago with a oh, it was a laptop bag actually, I think, and she gave me this manicure kit with it. And this comes in handy because sometimes I'll get a jagged nail and I gotta cut it, and you know. Thank you, Pam. I still have it. Yes, I do. Next thing in here is another Burberry <laughs> glass case. But this, these are my actual eyeglasses. Um, see, I'm putting, they're a little dirty. I need to clean them. But these are my actual eyeglasses that I wear. Did you see the little Burberry tartan there? I actually, um, I posted a picture when I first got them. My hair was longer. And it took me a while to get used to having framed glasses because my old eyeglasses were coach and they were frameless and i was used to not having to see a frame and now you see a frame and it's like what the heck is this so weird 
Uh, the next thing in here is my, um, this is my cow, my Dallas Cowboys lanyard with the keys to my mom's house. Um, when I did watch football, well, I, I'm still a, a Dallas Cowboys fan. I'm not a fan of the owner because I think he's a jackass. We're not going to talk about that, but I am a Dallas Cowboy fan. So to all my Cowboys, uh, Cowboy fans go boys. The next thing in here is a Beats little uh, carrying case. In here, I actually have a couple of pairs of Apple headphones. I have the ones for my phone with the new plug, and then I have a pair with the original plug. I use these uh, sometimes for my uh, MacBook Pro so I can listen to videos while I'm drying my hair. That's what I do. But I keep both of my sets of headphones in this case. But it's funny, I have the actual Beats headphones right here and they don't, I don't put them in the case. I'm a little weird. I don't know why. The next thing in here is my Kiehl's hand solve. Make sure I can put that in. There we go right there. My Kiehl's hand solve is ashy season. You better not walk out the house without some hand cream, okay? You a fool if you do. You's gonna have some ashy hands. And let's see, now let's get, oh wait, and another pack of tissue. Uh, during the cold season, I, if I'm very, very cold, my nose just starts to run. So I have to have, um, I have to have tissue on me. So it's one of those things. Okay, my purse has two side pockets. The first side pocket is a cord for my phone and a battery charger. I actually got this battery charger from my phone charger from FabFitFun, <laughs> actually. And I need to actually charge this because it's down. So I'm glad I actually pulled this out. But I'm actually going to put the cord back so I don't forget it. And my remote control to my monitor fell. Oh, well. And in the second pocket it are my contact lenses. I actually had these with me because I only have three sets left to get me through the year and I need to order I need to try to order another box of each because I have um I wear different uh prescriptions for my left and my right eye so I had to put left and right on them even though they put right on the back so um I've had a couple of hiccups with a couple of pairs so I have to I need to order some more contacts because I don't want to run out Cause I can't, I can't, I love my glasses. I just don't want to wear them every day. Cause I have great sunglasses. And now into the zipper pocket we go. Let's see what we got in here first. And the first thing we have is I have a coach. I have a coach card wallet here where I keep my bus pass. <laughs> I have my bus pass and something. Let's see what's in the pocket. Oh, I got it. Got a dollar in the pocket, yeah, baby. Always keep at least a dollar in here. If anything happens, always keep a dollar in here. Um, and that's really nothing else in here. I mainly got this for my butt so I can carry my bus pass. And if I have to go out without a purse, I can just stick my ID in here. And if I have any extra cards I wanna put in, I can just put in there without carrying my uh, Janine purse, uh, I mean, uh, wallet or anything else, I can just do that. Next are the house keys to this apartment. Uh, my mom gave us little Dooney and Burke holders. This is for pepper spray. And I lost my pepper spray, so I have to get some new pepper spray. So uh, yeah, I'm gonna have to go get on the Amazon for pepper spray. <laughs> I need my pepper spray. Next um, are wipes I got from Target. You gotta have a clean butt when you go to the bathroom. So, gotta have wipes. I always carry my wipes. Next is another coach card holder. Um, I don't put all my cards in my Louis Vuitton wallet. I, I did have all my cards in there and to me it was just too much. So I um, coached when they were having, um, what was it, 30% off sale. I happened to go in and I wanted a card wallet. So I grabbed an extra card wallet uh, to put like my insurance cards in and some of my other uh, non-credit card cards and some gift cards like you know I have the gap and um, Sally's gotta have a Sally's card I need to order lashes I'm running out of lashes <laughs> so I have to order lashes 
And let's see what else is in here. Um, I have a habit of keeping all the info for my purses in my purse. Um, it's a habit I have. It's really a weird habit that I have. And I do that to one, remind myself how much I spent. And two, uh, this is, you know, also the uh, care instructions for the bag. So I like to keep that in there too. And the last thing I have in here are some other woman things. You know, like I said, in case of emergency, you always carry woman stuff in here. And that's it for the bag. I mean, here is the empty bag right there. I just put the cord back in. But yeah, this is a really great size bag. And you saw all the stuff and everything is sitting out here on my table. And I'm going to take a picture of it and I'm going to put it right over here so you can see everything that was um, in the bag is right here on the table in front of me. And like I said, this bag holds a lot of stuff. And I really, I really love this bag. And that is it for this video. Um, if I can find any links to this bag, like on Fashion File or The Real Real, I will put them below. I believe Fashion File does have one of the versions, but I think it's um, taller. I'm sorry. I think it's a taller version. And I think The Real Real has a red um, version of this bag on their site. So I'm going to try to put the links to those in below for you all. So, and if you guys have any questions on this purse, any of the things that I carry in my bag, or if you have any other video suggestions, please talk to me below on this video and I will do what I can to get those videos out for you all. And if you like videos like this, please give me a thumbs up. And also, like I said earlier, subscribe to my channel. It would be so lovely if you do and you can come back and see me every week on Sundays. 10 o'clock central, 11 o'clock Eastern. I try to do Eastern, but I'm central. I do central time zone. So anyway, that is it. I'm going to put this stuff back in my purse because I have stuff to do. And I think I need to eat a little dinner. It's after five o'clock and the Schmugmeister, your, your good friend, the Schmugmeister is taking a little nap on my BLC shoe box. So let me get out of here. Uh, all my socials were at the beginning and that's it. I'll talk to you later. Love, peace and hair products. Bye.